Hello everyone, JRDL96 here with a brand new reaction. As you can tell by the title, it's another Crank Gameplays video and this one intrigued me. Looking at distressing memes. I wonder what that entails. Like that's just creepy meme, creepy, you know, images or memes or whatever. I have no idea. It's just intrigued me. So that's why I'm reacting to it. I have no idea. But anyways, I might as well just get right into it and see what this is all about. This has really, you know, intrigued me. And the, the start of this video does not help either because now it's just going to, you know, you know, freaking fuel up the uh, blank gameplays clips now. <laughs> so that's it. So anyways, let's just get right into it. So without a uh, duh, let's react to this video, shall we? I have to do the show. We're looking at I just saw that. Memes. These memes will make you uncomfortable. Oh, good lord. Someone told me about the, this subreddit. I can't remember who. And so I said, hey. It's real estate. So today, <laughs> we are here at r slash distressing memes. And it's all supposed to be memes. How is that possible? That are distressing. What is this? Oh, the, this uncanny, you know... Mr. Incredible meme that's taken the world by storm. What the hell? How did this become a meme? What is going on here? Now that I am seeing this, I see this now everywhere. What the hell? I see this thing everywhere. Who made? Like, what was the? Software dev. Okay, oh my done. god. The inspiration for that? I want to know who was like, all right. Who was the idiot that came up with this? How it started. Want to go out sometime? Oh my, oh my god, god yes. yes. How, it How it ended. Her face on the face. Who was that? Was that Ed Gein? That, uh, Ed Gein? Those beaver faces. Oh, Jesus Christ. There's that what face, I first? think, from Mandela Catalog. It's a combination of the first one, but it's a story. It's like now the there's bowl. a story behind they it. put you in the bowl? Who made this? Some bored person. They load you into the bowl. You slowly start roasting. Oh, yeah, that is like a... Fuck, this is a real thing. They that was a real thing bowl. back it's in like the old, the old days. The one that closes and it has all the spikes and you just... That's fucking nuts. Is it made out of... Okay, I'm done with that. One of the most frightening things I've ever heard is when someone pointed out that the existence of the Uncanny Valley impl implies that some, at some point, there was an evolutionary reason to be afraid of something that looked human, but it wasn't. What? Oh, weird. So are we talking about something that was in between? Yeah, I get it. If it's like, like something like so so the old Sonic design, I could say. What the fuck is this? Gmod. I've played Gmod in such a long time. I guess I, I did play... What the hell? How did, why did you uh, Undertaker, is that you? That's not supposed to happen. Is that the Undertaker? That's supposed to happen. Just give the Undertaker gong. <laughs> <laughs> and you sat up like for real. He's the Undertaker. The demon of Death Valley is coming. He cannot save you anyway. Me watching the so-called atheist start praying to God as I attach the car battery clamp to the... <laughs> What the leaving. hell? Me leaving, me leaving the only home I've ever, ever known on an escape pod, watching as Earth, Earth's core collapses in, in on itself, as I drift a hopelessly into the vast dark emptiness of space, alone, with only my thoughts until the end of my day. I really can't fucking. <laughs> oh my god! I saw that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Step one, wake up at eight in the morning. Step two. Step two, feel the sun's warmth emanating from the window. Step three. Step three, go into the living room to see your loving wife and children. I don't like where this is going. Step four. Where are my wife and children? 
Check five. Realize that you haven't been in this house since you were a child. Oh, God. Check six. Some what the hell is happening? The horrid salt pure expensive rotten flesh and brimstone pierces your nose like a rusty knife Fuck. to the skirt. Who's making these? Also, Someone's so bored out of their mo spaces. Out of their mind. They are really weird. They are really weird. Really, really, really weird and uncomfortable. Like this. That's a, an abandoned this, mall right there. Uh, that looks like an abandoned hospital. They're just odd. An abandoned supermarket. Just uncomfortable. Just like spaces <laughs> like this. I've been stalking for an hour stands on a time like and tells me the date of my death. It's oh, like, Jesus Christ. Christ. These are distressing memes. I've always been an intruder, but when I found you, I felt like a guest. Oh, it's that fucking ice cream cat. Oh, my God. Hey, Sonia. I see my crush. She noticed you. Okay. Uh huh. She starts walking towards you. Okay. Yes. Big, big, big eyes, heart eyes. She sits beside you. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. This is the perfect moment. This is the moment that I put. She starts to conversation. Of course, yes. She in she invites you to her house. Whoa. That's sick. You can put a boob in your oh, mouth. Oh, good she Christ. Takes off her jacket. That face. <laughs> oh, I knew it was going to go somewhere. Uh, why does that look like The Rock? Hold on. Am I wrong? No. Am I wrong? Oh, oh. That is I don't bad. Like, uh, this is unsettling to me. It's the Joker right there. The this is what happened when the Joker put his Joker gas in, you know, the train. Violently crashing. Teeth desperately chattering. Saliva dripping from their hungry mouths. It's spooky, dude. Me listening to the doctor explain that I'm not pregnant as I try to understand what's this thing moving inside my eye, my body is. Oh, it's just a poop. <laughs> what the coyote sees after eating my cat. Is that Joe Rogan? It's fucking mouth. Why do I have to hydrate? Jesus Christ, he eats elk meat. Mm, 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 oh, God, mm, yeah, mm, I see that. Mm, mm, oh, no. Mm, 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 That'd be horrible. When you cut when me when my ox splits apart, growing four rows of jagged teeth before it screeches and begins eating my balls. What? Um, squatters like freak me out. Like the thought of somebody else living in my house and I am unaware of it freaks me out real bad. The dog barking outside and some of her yelps and her silence. The sound of her footsteps coming up your porch start startles you as you decide to check your security cameras. Oh. No thanks. No. No, th no thank you. Don't ask me for the secret. Aww. You know? Push his baby. The face of God. <laughs> and it was weeping. <laughs> See, this is what I thought this fucking subreddit was gonna be. Shit like this, where it's just like, okay, this is kind of fucking weird and disturbing. I didn't think it was gonna be about people ripping other people's faces off. And it's just they don't like offerings. I'm Shakalaka. Oh my god. They don't know. What the hell? They don't know that I can break dance. They don't know I can <laughs> break dance. You snack late at night. As you, as you rummage through the fridge, all the lights you switch on on the way to the kitchen begin to turn up on one by one. Oh, there's a face back there. Oh my god, yeah. The internet is, uh, is that pretty much what this it's is? a place that we never let, should have let become a real thing. You know? Well. I scrolled through a lot of the memes there, and let me tell you, they got very distressing to the point where I don't want to be on the subreddit. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to be near that Some place ever funny, again. But mostly just, ah. All right, guys, well. Seriously, what is, why is the Mr. Incredible thing now a meme? I, I don't get, get it. Too distressed, but hey, at least we saw some funny Bob Parr memes. Am I right? What a hunk. What a daddy. No. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to slap that like button right in the face. And I will see you guys in the next video. Love you all. Stay cranky. Bye. Oh, you motherfucker. I see those eyes. But... What the fuck? What the fuck? Why do we have coordinates now? 3480. Is that what I saw?
Um, what does that have to do? What was those coordinates? What? I have no idea. I'll try to look it up on my own time, but what the fuck? Seriously. Seriously, I don't under... Like, this is the thing about, like, you know, certain, you know, things. It's like, they get... Like, I feel like this is how a meme is born. Some random guy in the in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of this planet, is like, hmm, that Mr. Incredible picture looks pretty interesting. Let me make it disturbing. Make it uncanny. And then it just fucking spreads like a fucking virus. And it just continues to get worse and worse and worse. That's pretty much what this whole new Mr. Incredible uncanny meme thing has become. Completely stupid and ridiculous. It's like, I see this now everywhere I go. Everywhere I'm on social media, Instagram, or Twitter, or whatever. Everywhere I see it, even on sometimes Reddit. When I go on Reddit sometimes, I see it. And it's like, what the fuck is this supposed to be? What is the point of it? I get it. It's a, it's a fucking unsettling picture because someone decided to Photoshop it into a more realistic looking person. And to make it look creepier. But seriously, it's getting ridiculous now. I feel like it's getting... I think it's run its course. It's just getting going to get worse and worse. But that one with, the, you know, the, the girl, your crush. So you're saying your crush is a killer. I think Ed Gain was the person who did wear people's skin. Um, which I think inspired Leatherface. I believe, from the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Who does that? So, when he was talking about... Was that Ed Gain? Like, he said Ed... You know, he said the last name wrong. It was Ed Gain, as far... As, from what I've heard, it's Gain, not, you know, whatever he said. But, yeah, th that Reddit is somewhere... Someplace I will never usually go to. And hopefully I never go there again. Because that was so unsettling, I did not want to know what I... I want to, like, you know, clean out my eyes, use my use eye bleach to clean out whatever I just saw. Like, I feel like that place could be a great place for Reddit 5050 challenges. Seriously, some of that stupid shit over there could definitely be perfect for, you know, Reddit 5050. <laughs> Ugh. Anyways. That's really it on this reaction. I think another video... Ethan just did recently was him showing his favorite TikToks, I think, which is a continuation of, you know, you sent me cringe TikToks when he said that at the end. He's like, oh, I'm going to start a series of, you know, me showing you my favorite TikToks. And I'm like thinking to myself, well, is somebody taking a page out of somebody else's playbook? Some got some septic person, you know, him. Oh, my gosh. Holy crap. Like. The freaking video that Mark and Ethan did in that it eating, you know, peanut butter alternatives is like creeping up against, you know, Ethan's video when he got his wisdom teeth pulled. And obviously that little thing in the beginning when he's like, you know, doing a creepy, you know, stare into the camera. That was obviously like I saw for like a brief second, I saw the words this show and i'm like it's obviously just another little sub you know a little reference to the you know the whole you know fact that he's going on his tour i have to do this show you know i have to do this tour you know stuff like that and i'm going to the show in new york so i cannot wait for that and hopefully it goes well but anyways that's really it on this reaction um i'm just gonna get right into you know doing the next video so i'll see you guys then so hope you guys enjoyed if you did, the like button, subscribe, share this video with your friends. Be sure to ring that bell to be part of the notification squad. Be sure to check out my Instagram because I make clothes at Markiplier, Jack Septiguy, and myself. I was from Actors of Cosplays on there, so go check it out. Be sure to check out my Tumblr and my Discord in the description as well. So until next time, JRDL96 signing out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.